Hi guys, I hope you are doing well. Welcome to my channel. In this clip, I want to introduce a package for having some extended standard uh, shaders and materials in our Unity project. For example, uh, Cloud Sphere or uh, I don't know some flakes on the sphere or other objects we want. Okay. First, we should take a look at this pack, uh, package over here, Extended Standard, which is released uh, four years ago by Chenyun to GitHub. Yeah, this guy. I will share the link of this package in the description of this video. You just need to download the zip file of this project and drag and drop assets folder content into the, your uh, projects folder. After that, Okay, we should come over here. We see we will see in the extended standard folder we will have game shader skybox and sample scene. Okay, first we should take a look at the sample scene itself. Look at this. I just want to talk about just this and this beautiful cloud fur. Look at this. It is just a simple Close, but it's a simple object. Uh, the object itself doesn't have any mesh or any fur itself. All of these fur you will see uh, is coming from the material. Okay, and this guy actually close for fur material. Uh, for example, if I now let me show you. see better okay if we wanna make a quad here and make it bigger and now I want just to drag and drop fur material to this guy but you will see it is something like this but for this guy it works better uh, now we can change some parameters so essential parameters over here uh, for example fur length look at this it's almost better for us but for this guy it's not too much but it's fair enough okay uh, for example alpha cutoff it's almost the same but for this guy, alpha cutout end. Look at this. This is much more smoother now. Look at this. It is fine. Or even edge fade. Look at this. You can change these parameters whenever you want. And even gravity strings. Look at this. It's almost you now bend. All right. Excellent. But I prefer to keep the normal parameters because I want to see this beautiful one here. Uh, for this sphere, we have the same method, but in the clear code. A shader of the material uh, as you can see it is this guy character mystery uh, kingstone tt character clear code okay look at this we have the color itself we can change any color you want we want and the same for alpha cutout and the smoothness look at this it's there for actually a reflection but at this part we have base bump flex strings look at this and now it's better if we want to make a beautiful one all right and it is for the light reflection as well reflection as well okay I hope this tutorial will be helpful for you. Don't hesitate to ask any question related to Unity, AR, VR, and XR. Subscribe to my channel and like this video if you like it. Have a great time. Bye bye.